Hello, my name is John Nagoski, and I'm a native speaker of English from Wisconsin in the USA. I would like to introduce to you my English reading channel with questions and answers. Slow progress is better than no progress. Stay positive and don't ever give up. English conversation. We bought a computer from you yesterday and it won't turn on. Press the big button. I have. Then try the cord at the back. Maybe it's disconnected. I'll get a flashlight. Don't go away. I'll be right back. Why do you need a flashlight? It's dark. We have no electricity. English idiom. Get hitched. Get hitched. The meaning. To get married. Did you hear? Sarah and David got hitched last week. They got hitched last year without telling anybody about it. Get hitched. Common English expression. To have a frog in my throat. To have a frog in my throat. The meaning. When you have a frog in your throat, it means that your voice is hoarse. This usually occurs when you have a cold or from excessive talking. She had a frog in her throat, so she had a drink of water before she went on speaking. To have a frog in my throat. English quiz. Two, two things is to combine them into one whole thing. A. Merge. B. Magnify. C. Manipulate. D. Maintain. Which one do you think is the correct answer? Perhaps one of the most important life skills is the ability and willingness to learn. By learning new skills, we increase our understanding of the world around us and equip ourselves with the tools we need to live a more productive and fulfilling life, finding ways to cope with the challenges that life throws at us. Most people associate learning with a formal education, but learning can and should be a lifelong process that enhances our understanding of the world and improves the quality of our life. English Vocabulary Squabbling, squabbling, the meaning, arguing. My neighbors are squabbling again. They're so loud. Squabbling. Quarrel, quarrel, the meaning, to argue or fight. George and Julie quarrel night and day. They fight over the most trivial things. Quarrel. English quiz. Jenny really looks to her older sister and copies everything she does. A. In. B. Towards. C. Up. D. Down. Which one do you think is the correct answer? One of the most popular forms of expressing love is a hug. A hug expresses warmth, closeness, and security. Hugs, kisses, and cuddling exist because it makes people feel safe and appreciated. After a tough, long day at work, people feel the most love through a nice, warm hug. English quiz. If something is, it is very old and rare and therefore valuable. A. Academic. B. Adequate. C. Awkward. D. Antique. Which one do you think is the correct answer? Common English expression. Ups and downs. Ups and downs. The meaning, good and bad times. Life is full of ups and downs. Ups and downs. 
Your age is only a number that signifies how long you have been walking on this earth. It is nothing but a series of numbers, and you will never know what happiness is if you are constantly worrying about your age. Although your age does give you some perspective, it does not define your life. You can do or be anything at any age, no matter how young or old you are. Age is just a number. How you feel and live your life is more important. Riddle me this: I can fly, but I have no wings. I can cry, but I have no eyes. What am I? Life has knocked me down a few times. It has showed me things I never wanted to see. I have experienced the loss of loved ones, sadness, and many failures. But one thing is for sure: I always get back up and keep moving forward. English quiz: A、uh, is a shaking movement the body makes when someone is cold or scared. A shoulder, B shiver, C shadow. D shield. Which one do you think is the correct answer? No family is perfect. We argue. We fight. We even stop talking to each other at times. But in the end, family is family. The love will always be there. Be kind to yourself. Learning English is not easy. When you find yourself saying, "I can't speak English," add the phrase, "But I'm learning and getting better every day." There are pros and cons for both online shopping and in-store shopping. It all comes down to several reasons and each person's preference. In-store shopping allows you to buy something immediately, especially if you need a product fast. Online shopping is convenient because you can do it from the privacy of your own home. There is no real right answer when it comes to in-store shopping or online shopping. The fact is that they both have advantages and disadvantages in certain areas. In the end, it all comes down to each shopper and what they feel is important to them. English idiom. A big hit, a big hit. The meaning: a very successful thing. My pizza was a big hit. Everybody loved it. A big hit. English vocabulary: influencer, influencer. The meaning: a person who makes money through social media. Karen is a social media influencer. Teen girls love her makeup tips. Influencer. English vocabulary. Accomplishment. Accomplishment. The meaning. Achievement. Lila won the best young female lawyer award. It was a great accomplishment. Accomplishment. One of the most important ways to get and keep positive energy in your life has to do with who you hang out with. Do your friends lift you up or bring you down? Are they critical or complimentary? Positive friendships provide support when you're down, fun when you're up, and wisdom when you're lost. Good friends can inspire you to reach greater heights and see your strengths even when you don't. More than 90% of human communication consists of body language. When you see the way that the person you are talking to reacts, you are able to better understand how they are feeling. One of the benefits of face-to-face -face communication is the live feedback translated through the body language and facial expressions. You can also hear the tone of their voice, which makes it easier to interpret the person's feelings. Also, you are able to show your own reactions and emotions. Face-to-face -face communication will enhance your credibility and help build trust between you and the other person.
More than 90% of human communication consists of body language. When you see the way that the person you are talking to reacts, you are able to better understand how they are feeling. One of the benefits of face-to-face -face communication is the live feedback translated through the body language and facial expressions. You can also hear the tone of their voice, which makes it easier to interpret the person's feelings. Also, you are able to show your own reactions and emotions. Face-to-face -face communication will enhance your credibility and help build trust between you and the other person.